what we're working on right now is getting out to into the alpha network all these things that have been completed already. And this includes updates to uh, HAP management. You know, that was part of what our publisher alpha and milestone was a while back. We've got all of the hosting payments that has been being tested. This means the generation of invoices, the service logs that are created for them, the automatic payment of those invoices in the full distributed uh, network way. Those are those are underway and they're in our QA environment. We just haven't pushed them into the alpha environment at this stage. Um, where our devs are working, go ahead. Arthur. Just to note, since the screen just got shared, the filled in oh. circles mean they're complete. And so you yes. can all the way up to the in progress thing. Right. Go ahead. Great. So, so where we are right now fully is that we've done about half of this milestone right here for the hot hole of fuel reserve. This is getting all of the reserve, it, reserve infrastructure in place so that we can be doing the hot hole of fuel swap so that we can be doing the ongoing hot to hole of fuel redemptions um, back for uh, hosts as well. And then we're also working on this thing called source chain persistence. So David, part of the question you asked were there, are there any big what was that? What was the way it was uh, 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 worded? I, it was I, I basically, it, is there anything yeah, around like technical blockers or big advancements? Yeah, exactly. Right, right. So I would say that there were big problems to be solved over the past six months, but a lot of those have been architected and resolved. And now a couple of them are waiting for certain things to be completed by the whole chain team to be able to support the implementation that Holo is going to be doing. So at this stage, I'd say that we're pretty close to saying the big issues have been solved and now it is working and getting it complete and getting it into that basically release candidate that has all the requirements that we need to be in for beta. But then as we've discussed many, many times before, after that, we have security reviews, we have scalability testing, there's some significant things that have to be done to ensure security at the infrastructure layers, um, and we're working with third parties to do a lot of that. So um, those are the pieces that, that will take a little bit of time after we even get to those release candidates. But I'd say we're in really good shape right now, and we're really getting ourselves geared up to be able to release a lot of this work in the coming months.